As many people prepare to travel for the holiday season, well, have you thought about what you're going to do if your flight gets canceled or changed? For one group of strangers, they put their heads and their wallets together to find a solution. Hundreds of thousands of travelers will take to the sky and hit the road in the weeks between Thanksgiving and Christmas. That also could mean some hiccups along the way. They didn't have enough crew to get us there. That's why our flight was delayed. Elena Story was traveling with her mom and godmother when they got stuck in Orlando and needed to get back to Knoxville. We find out that our flight's canceled and they don't fly every day. So I think our flight was canceled on like Sunday night. We wouldn't have been able to leave till Tuesday. With not many options, they took the road less traveled. So me and a bunch of strangers in my family, we decided to rent a 15 passenger van. 15 strangers, one large van, all headed to Knoxville. My name is Q and we're stuck. Bop. I'm uh, my name is Seth, and I got stuck here in Orlando after visiting some friends. Story admits there were some hesitations. Are we really going to do this, and is this safe? But after more than a 10-hour car ride together, these strangers felt like family. She thinks that's why her TikToks documenting the trip are going viral. Part of why people like this story so much is because you can literally, like, see we have, we, on paper, we have nothing in common. Like, we don't know each other. It's like total strangers from different countries and everything. The TikTok experience is what really, like, made it a fun trip. I'm really glad I thought to do that because, like, the whole time, it was a noisy van, okay? Like, there was no sleep in there. Like, the whole time, they're refreshing it over and over again. Oh, we're at this many views. We're at this many views. Look at these comments. Like, they're reading all these comments out loud. The group finally pulled into Knoxville around 8.30 Monday morning. So let's wrap this story up, okay? Story says this unexpected experience came with some unexpected realizations, too. This, for me, like, really restored, like, my faith in humanity. You know, we didn't know each other, total strangers. And... I didn't know them, but like I kind of put my trust in them a little bit and it didn't backfire on me. So it kind of just like, it was very restorative to see like people just be good to be good. So for those getting ready to travel this season, here's some advice. One for sure, go with the flow. Like, yeah, things are going to happen, but like if you search hard enough, like you're probably going to be able to find like some sort of positive outcome for things. All right, now, Elena says that she does plan on keeping in touch with some of her new friends. She's actually going to a karaoke night with some of them this week. So hopefully they have fun with this new friendship here. As for the airline, they were flying Frontier. I did reach out to them to comment on the videos. They said, quote, we sincerely apologize for the inconvenience caused by the flight cancellation. All customers had the option of waiting for the next available Frontier flight or receiving a full refund, end quote.